Hey guys, what's up? You're welcome back to my channel. I know you're wondering why you can't see my face. Uh-uh, what is going on? I can only hear your voice. I cannot see your face. What's popping? Guys, calm down. Let me explain myself, okay? Because I know I need to explain what's going on here. I figured that most times I have some ideas I want to share with you guys. But because I do not have enough time to sit down and actually film them, I sometimes forget or I just procrastinate and never ever do anything about it. So I just told myself, you know what, Betha, if you cannot see down in front of your camera to talk about stuff maybe you should just do like a recording of yourself talking about it and just post it here as some kind of podcast you know that way you can listen to me while you go about your duties or just other things that you have to do does that work let me know in the comment section what you guys think about this i know you guys want to see my face and this is not going to stop me from posting my normal vlogs i'm just saying that sometimes there are things that i feel are pressing matters you know pressing topics that i want to talk about but because I don't have the time, because I don't have the luxury of filming every single time I want, that's why I chose to do it this way. Now that you guys understand where I'm coming from, let's get right into the video. Because from the topic, you guys can already tell that I'm here to give you some tips and tricks on how to get your first 100 subscribers on YouTube fast. Okay, you guys know that getting your first 100 subscribers is usually the hardest, in my opinion, because it was a struggle, okay, and I just consider that to be the hardest milestone on youtube okay now the first tip for you guys would be to promote your channel i know you guys already have questions like I i'm better i'm just starting out and you're already telling me to promote my channel look when i say promote i don't really mean you spending your money i'm talking about you sending your youtube link to your friends and your families you know you ask them to subscribe and also tell them to help you repost the links on their social media platforms be it on their whatsapp status on their instagram stories or facebook for those people who use facebook and of course snapchat as well all right tell them to help you post these links and just urge people to subscribe that way you're sure to get some people to subscribe to your channel okay the next would be for you to post your links on all your social media platforms look do not neglect these things don't be like oh, i don't want my family members to know that i do youtube now i don't want them to start laughing at my crappy videos and all of that look you need to be shameless to do youtube okay you cannot be telling people to post your stuff for you when you're not even making any move at all okay people need to know what you're doing people need to understand that you've taken this as either a job or a hobby either ways you need to get people to subscribe to your channel your mom is going to subscribe your dad is going to subscribe your sisters your brothers your colleagues your church members and i mean by the time all these people subscribe you already have like 20 to 25 subscribers right so we have 75 to go now the second tip would be for you to do the sub for sub look i need to break that down because i know that a lot of us here on youtube hate that sub for sub thing like it actually irritates me but guess what it works especially because you're trying to get your first 100 subscribers you do not really care if they're watching your videos at this point you actually need the numbers you actually need your subscribers to grow okay when they grow there's a tad big chance that they're definitely going to watch your videos so just go on and do the whole sub for sub thing but i need to mention that this sub for sub thing is against the youtube guidelines but who says you have to do it on youtube you don't actually have to do the sub for something on YouTube because it could actually get your channel in trouble. So you can take that away from YouTube and just go and do your sub for sub on Instagram. Look, when I was trying to grow my other channel, I had a lot of people just come on my Instagram page to say, oh, sub for sub, you know, sub to me, I'll sub to you. Send me a screenshot to prove to me that you subscribe to my channel. I'll do that. And then they'll also send me a screenshot of them subscribing to my channel. I know sometimes these people go back to unsubscribe, but guess what? Not a lot of them will even remember the name of your channel after subscribing. So there's no loss okay another way to go about it on instagram is to search for hashtag small youtuber or hashtag youtube support and find people that are still online and just let them know that you make videos and just comment on their posts you can just comment stuff like want to be friends on youtube or sub for sub you know just exchange proof of screenshots like i said that way it will definitely help you get some more subscribers but make sure to drop this habit as soon as you get your 100 subscribers okay because it could land you in serious trouble don't say better did not warn you I'm telling you that these tips can work, but I'm also telling you that you don't have to do it excessively. You dig? Cool. Now, the next tip would be for you to comment on other people's YouTube videos. Of course, you're on YouTube, so you need to make your presence known. You need to announce yourself. Nobody's going to announce you for you, okay? You need to start going on people's channels and, you know, just placing comments there. But first, you need to search for recent videos that are similar to yours. Now, the next thing would be for you to actually take time to watch those videos. You don't want to be that person who just goes around commenting, love this video, love this video, I enjoyed it, when indeed you did not watch the video. That's really annoying. And true Truthfully, I can tell that you did not watch my video if you comment stuff like that, okay? So make sure to watch that video. 
watch it, understand what they are saying, and then place a comment that is relatable to what they have just posted. So imagine that the person posted a video on how to draw your brows. Please don't go there and just write I like this video. You need to comment stuff like, oh, I actually don't draw my brows this way. I use this pencil to draw my brows, or I just carve my brows this way. Just something relatable so that they know that you actually watch the content that they put out there. Now, after you have done that, you can then go ahead to tell them that you have a similar video like that on your channel. That way, they know that you are on YouTube and there's a chance of them visiting your channel knowing fully well that you post the same stuff as they do, okay? Now, the next one will be for you to work on your brand. I know that you're a small channel and you're trying to grow and a lot of times we don't actually pay attention to our branding and all of that. I was guilty of that as well so I'm speaking from experience, okay? You need to work on your brand. Let people know what you're about from the get-go. Don't confuse anybody. Don't make them feel like, ah, uh -uh, this person doesn't even know what he or she is doing here on YouTube. All right, you need to work on your profile picture. You need to work on your channel art or just your layout. You need to also work on your channel trailer. Now, for your channel trailer, what you can do is post your most successful video as your trailer so that once anybody visits your channel, that's the first video that they would come in contact with, okay? Now, this is basically the tips I have for you guys. I'm sure that by the time you do all of these things and you do it religiously, not like you do it for one day and leave it and say oh better all these things you said did not work you need to try it out for a period of time before it can actually work okay if you actually want to grow on youtube you cannot get tired easily okay you need to be patient youtube takes a lot of time and trust me if you're not patient you cannot survive on youtube i'm saying it now if you're not patient please just delete that channel don't even bother don't stress yourself because guess what if you don't know how to be patient youtube will teach you by fire by force so the earlier you're aware of these things the better i'm not saying it's going to come easy i'm not saying oh once you do all of these things it's going to happen in two days or something no you have to actually keep up with it before it can work but trust me i can guarantee you that this is going to get you your first hundred subscribers and once you surpass the hundred subscriber count trust me subscribers are going to keep coming it's not like they're going to now start flying in. No. Don't say better said they'll start flying in. No, they would actually start coming because now you have a hundred subscribers and of course you're posting valuable content. So people will definitely want to check out what you're about and all that stuff. Now that's basically all I have for you guys in this. I don't know if to call it a podcast. Guys, I think we should just go with a podcast, okay? So this is my first podcast on my YouTube channel and i want you guys to tell me what you think about it to be honest i feel like this is more effective for me when i want to talk about youtube stuff and just all of these youtube advices because it enables me to look into my notes the way i have written them out and make sure to give you guys the point without beating around the bush okay so let me know what you guys think let me know if you're going to try out these tips and tricks that i have mentioned and if you have more tips and tricks on how to get our first hundred subscribers let me know what they are in the comment section trust me this information is definitely going to be useful to upcoming youtubers small youtubers like ourselves like i said in the beginning this is just a way to help ourselves grow as a community here on youtube so let's help one another it's actually not possible for me to know everything so yes let's help one another drop your ideas there's no carrying of first position or second position on youtube if you blow you blow if you not blow you not blow like forget about it okay so let's just try and be our brothers and sisters keeper all right if you have questions or just any other topic you'd like me to talk about let me know what they are in the comment section and i'll definitely see to it that i give you guys an answer okay like i said i'm not a pro you guys know that i'm trying to grow as much as you guys are trying to grow so this is me just trying to help you guys out while we all grow here on youtube guys it's 2020 we need to blow we need to start cashing out here on youtube okay thank you guys so much for listening to me i hope this wasn't boring i hope i wasn't too fast just let me know what you guys think about this concept in the comment section do you guys want me to do more of it did you guys enjoy what i talked about today just let me know react okay react i'm trying to grow my channel too so yeah i need all the teas all right thank you guys so much and i will see you in my next video bye